<laughs> you would tell me, because uh, I was like, Us is the scariest thing I've ever seen ever. Yeah. Uh, and you do that movie, and I go, how do you keep it light on set? Oh. Okay, so Winston Duke was like the king of dad jokes. And so he would tell these awful, awful dad jokes. And then Shahadi, who played my daughter, she had a, quite a respectable canon. Hers were always a little more funny. And, and Evan, Evan was lame too. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and so, but I had nothing to share. So what I do to unwind in the evening after a day of shooting is I would scour the internet for dad jokes and I would save them on my phone and then like refer to them while we were on set and be like, oh, oh, I just came up with this one. You know? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what was it? Do you have a favorite dad joke? What's a good one? Okay. Um, did you hear about the kidnapping in the park? No. He was very tired. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the kidnapping. Kidnapping. That's a good one. <laughs> Trying to think if I have one. Uh, okay. Okay, yeah. I, I think I have one. Um, uh, what's Harry Potter's favorite way to go down a hill? Um, what? Walking. <laughs> J J JK, rolling. Oh, my God. <laughs> Come on. Come on, that's pretty good, right? It's all right, it gets there. Uh, it's, 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 it's a two-step. You usually leave the room, you're walking, and then you, then you, then you come back. And, JK, rolling. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's talk about this book, by the way. Yeah. Uh, I love it, by the way. It is fantastic. Suwe, so, uh, tell, tell me what this is about. And this is basically about you, right? Yeah, it's... Uh... Uh, liberal autobiography, really. <laughs> yeah. um, it's about this girl called Suwe. Suwe means star in my mother tongue, Luo. And she's born the darkest in her family and the, dar the darkest in her school. And she's very uncomfortable with her skin and wants to go about changing it. But then a magical night through the night sky changes her mind and she learns how to love herself. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful story. Did you do what this girl does too? I mean, she tries to like eat lighter foods to change yeah. her skin color. Yeah, my thing, I, I wrote a, spe I, I gave a speech at the Essence uh, Women in Hollywood back in 2014 about my journey with, with f dealing with colorism and prejudice and all that. And one of the things I spoke about was I would pray to God every night for lighter skin because my mom told me God performs miracles. So I thought, oh, well, here's one for me. Uh, give me some light skin. Like, I had a younger sister who was much lighter. And so every morning I'd wake up and run to the mirror and see whether he answered my prayer. And I'd always be so disappointed. And so that's one of the things that Suwe does in this book. Yeah. And, and I, I, you think about that. I mean, I have kids now, so I, I'm extra sensitive to bullying or any of that stuff now for every kid. Not just my kid, but mm -hmm. every kid. Mm -hmm. I think this is such a great book to, to, for everyone to read if anyone's dealing with this stuff. Like, just yeah. love yourself and you're, you're good. Yeah, and it's also for people who don't know about colorism to get to know about it. You know, it's a mirror for dark-skinned girls to see themselves, specifically because I didn't have that growing up and I wanted to kind of use the pain that I felt um, for it to be my, my weapon, my gift, you know. And, um, but also for other people who might not know, I hope that this book is a window into understanding uh, what people that may not be like you can go through. But ultimately, the message is that the most important thing is to love yourself before anything else. That's great. I think you're going to change a lot of lives. <laughs> Lupita Nyong'o, everybody. Sulwe is available for pre-order now. <laughs> Little Monsters, by the way. Oh, yes. I didn't talk about Little Monsters. <laughs> Uh, uh, you're, you're in another scary movie. Yes. You have to stop making these scary movies. <laughs> well, this one's not scary. This one's way more funny than scary. Yeah. It's got zombies, it's got ukuleles, it's got children, it's got, it's got animals. <laughs> zombies and ukuleles, I'm sold. <laughs> yeah, and it's got terrible language, so please, it's not for children, despite the fact that it has children in it. Okay, <laughs> Little Monsters uh, is, uh, is out this week. Uh, uh -huh. and on and on. Uh, I said... And it's on and on and on